What is up, guys? It's your boy, No Risk, No Premium, back with another episode of the Two Minute Drill. Well, <clears throat> if you watched the Two Minute Drill yesterday, it was scary fucking good. I guess a Halloween edition of how today played out. Mwahahaha. Okay, just kidding. All jokes about all jokes aside, we really did call it though. We said what we're likely to get a fake out to both sides. Why? Because when the market trends, it blanks. Okay, the market trends or it consolidates. You guys crushed it in the comments yesterday. Kudos to you. And we especially consolidate into what? Major catalyst events. Well, tomorrow is Mr. It's time for Mr. Fuck Yo puts Jerome Powell, the federal chair, uh, and the FOMC event. So no, no time like the present for us to chop. So what did they do? What did the market maker do? Well, he decided to gap you up five points. He said, let's see how many people we can get to go long at open, right? Let's see how many people. Well, if you went long at open, you got completely bent over. Then he dropped us like the end of the world was coming. Okay. And that's what caused us. He put us underneath yesterday's uh, uh, low. Okay. And then he bounced us back up from there. We pretty much based in a, about a, what, you guys say it was a $1 range, really? Uh, you know, after we bounced from that bottom right here, we went from pretty much 384 and we went up to about 385 the whole day. Okay, 384, you know, 50-ish, just talking about body candles, not even wicks, right? Look at this tight-ass range. But you would have thought the world was ending from right here all the way down. This point is where we all went long. Okay. And a very nice trade. If you're with us in the Wolves of Wealth Discord, um, a lot of us, I mean, the trade happened very quickly. I believe we got in here on this 15 and we we're out by this, this pop right here. Okay. Very nice trade. Contracts move very, very nice. Some people had huge wins. Uh, we bought some time. So I think we grabbed like 30%, like 15 minutes. Nicely done. Um, and then we proceeded to chop the whole rest of the day. Okay, so what do we expect for tomorrow? Well, tomorrow is simple. Because tomorrow is FMOC, we are either going to break below this 383 or above 390, I promise you. Okay, I promise you, one of them will likely give. Okay, so which one will it be? I have no idea. All I know is this. If you go back and look, most previous meeting, FOMC meeting, you look, oh, it's on the 20th. Okay, let's take it. A peek back to the 20th here. Okay. Uh, right. That's what I want to make sure it is. It's the FOMC meeting uh, September 20th. All right, cool. So now we go like this. You want to go to the 15 minute chart. Um, well, you know what? We're gonna want to do a special time frame. We're gonna want to go 180 days, 15 minute, okie dokie, or the chokey. Sorry, it's got to aggregate all the data, right. Where are we at? Uh, oh. 180 day, 15 minute. What? Hold on. Wait a second. Why can't I zoom in on anything? Okay, maybe if we go to the daily, here we go. All right. Because we got 9.30, wait, 9.20, sorry, 9.20, which was this candle right here. We auto zoom it. We go to the 15 that we just made. Oh, well, you know what? This is going to be intraday. That's why I found. Sorry about that, y'all. Would have thought I had this done already, huh? So now we go like this and go drawings because you want to pull it. And now we just go like this and we're like, look, what are we in? What month is this? Eight. Okay, that's August. Here we go. August. Here we go. 920 is over here boom boom okay so now you're gonna grab these drawing you want to go to the mouse thing okie dokie now look here's 920 or 920 the actual news comes out 921 okay if you're looking at the last one 
So what happened? What happened? What happened? What happened? Okay, the first thing's first right at 11 o'clock. Okay. You get a pop-up. It's hard to see. Maybe we... I don't want to go to the five-minute because it will fuck it all up. You see this pop-up? It's that huge resistance. Very first move is a fake out up. Okay. My plan tomorrow is to short this initial fake out to the upside. Normally, I like to just buy the dip, right? Normally, I just like to buy the dip. Tomorrow, this pop up, I'm going to short any pop right at 11. Okay, then by the time he comes on at 1130, the market starts to react to what he says. And if he doesn't say anything different than what the notes say, okay, we go Ripper McGill. Okay, that'll be the second trade I will be making tomorrow. Okay, that'll be the second trade. Then after that, really depending on what he says, normally the next day we sold out, we sell off, but we've been starting to sell off intraday. That is a third trade that you can make. Okay, that is a third trade. However, we are in the middle. Okay, what's different this time is we are in the middle, right, of what? Okay, November 3rd, uh, I'm sorry, the 30th, right, was back here. Get back in this time here. <clears throat> we are in the middle of a bear market rally. The trend was most definitely down here during this last meeting. Okay. So now this meeting's a tad bit different. Technically, okay, not macro tech economics, just technical standpoint, technical analysis. Okay. We are in an uptrend. We are by the dip. Okay. So I will be looking for a possible sell off. But if it doesn't come, it would come possibly the next day. So I think the two safe trades are to short the initial pop, okay, and then long the bottom into Powell's coming on and talking. After that, get in, get out. Don't stick around to see if the fucking cops show up. Okay, so tomorrow, what's likely to be our range? Well, it's going to look like 385 to 390, okay, is going to be our range. I mean, I really call it wherever the, the 8 or 5 EMA opens up at. Okay, you'll want to see where that opens up at. My lean with the $2 billion buy side MOC, my lean for tomorrow, slight gap up. Slight, okay? Get a little closer to this major resistance up here, right? Get a little closer to this major resistance. Then we chop around all day, okay? Then when the news comes, hit resistance. We go down to support, and then we go back to resistance. That's what we need to look for, okay? So, guys. Like I said, it'll be smart for you to what? Go back outside of this meeting, or you could just go back on our YouTube channel where I laid this out probably about two months ago. I went back and looked at every single FOMC event. Go and check it out, okay? But if you want to, all you have to do is go up here and click FOMC meetings on the on the Federal Board of, uh, Board of Governors, Federal Reserve System on their website, right? Click FOMC meetings, start hitting previous, not the minutes, Okay, previous meeting. So now you can go back. Look, July 26, 27. You better write this down. You got a notepad out. Okay. FOMC meeting, June 5th, June 14th to 15th. Okay. May 3rd, May 4th. Okay. March 15th, 16th. Go back and look. What's the similarity? It's a pop-up on the initial minutes or on the initial news that comes, right? At right at it's 11 a.m. my time. Okay. But it's 2 p.m. Eastern. Okay, there's initial pop. Okay, then we drop to support. Then Powell comes on 30 minutes later. We rip up and likely sell the end of day. Okay, but the first two are what? I'm going to short the first top and I'm going to long the first bottom. Okay, after he starts talking. After that, I'm probably done for the day and I'll let to see how the day plays out. Okay, it doesn't fucking matter what he says to. You just react to your levels. It doesn't matter what he says. You just react to his levels. Okay, does everybody hear me? All right, other than that, guys, uh, levels to look out for, okay, if we do break 390 or if we do break below 383, I'll go through them real quick. Over 390, okay, 392, 396, 400 psych level, 403. It's the beginning of the gap fill, brings us 408, 200 MA. We have to get through the 100 MA, 388 first. That's the brown dotted line here. Remember, we're still above the purple dotted is the 50 MA 382 now. Okay, 382. Something to pay attention to. Underneath 380, 
I would take I would say underneath 383 now. Uh this day's low candle. 380. Okay, you'll maybe run into some trouble here at uh, 382 where this 21 or this 8 EMA opens up at, but I would think 380 probably gets kissed. 378, 376, 370. Okay, 364, 360, 357, 348 underneath. Guys, we are not predictors. We are not fortune tellers. We are reactors. Today, if you would have reacted in a such manner that you saw the biggest double top ever, you would have went short. Okay? You would have went short. Okay? We are traders, not, not, not fortune tellers, not future tellers, none of that. We are reactors. That's why we have levels and we paint a picture or a story of what we should do at each level. Okay? So it was short 390. Okay, short 390. We knew we consolidate into the Fed minute. So if you were thinking long this morning at 390, you need to reevaluate your mindset. If the market consolidates more often than it trends, i.e. breaks out, we were definitely set up for a consolidation day today. Okay, so we weren't going to break out of 390. All right, guys, that's all I got, though. Wake up early, okay? I will not be trading the actual pre-market or the actual open, though. However, Mr. Or one of our admins is, is one of the greatest IV players of all time. He has a fucking rock star strategy. I will be up in the market early watching for local highs and lows. And we'll be playing our IV pump strategy. And then I'll come in on live right into where um, uh, where he comes out. I'll be on 15 minutes before uh, the news comes out and, and uh, the federal chair comes out. And then we'll walk exactly through how we're going to play our scalping, okay, of shorting the initial pop and long in the first bottle. We'll walk through it on live, give call outs, all good stuff. Guys, if you're not in the Discord yet, hit the link below. Come join us, okay? We have a great time, great community, great culture, great traders. Everybody's making money. It's a fun time, all right? If not, you know, I guess you could keep on watching the two-man drill. Hopefully you're banking, but it's even, it's even more fun when you're doing it with the Wolfpack, okay? Guys, get up. Don't do anything fucking stupid. I'll see you bright and early. Peace.